I am Miss Ebony V. Welcome back or to my channel. So today I have another human hair slay and yes, this unit comes courtesy of the oh so wonderful Timu. Thank you Timu for sponsoring another video and sending me this unit. I truly, truly do appreciate it. So if you're unfamiliar with Timu, they are an online marketplace with competitively priced products in the genres of beauty, hair, fashion, makeup, I said beauty, jewelry, pet supplies, home decor, any and everything you can think of, trust and believe, Timu has got it. Make sure you check them out. I will list their information down in the description box below. Definitely want to check them out. I have done several Timu wig reviews at this point or reviews in general. So I do have a Timu playlist that I will link here up above. Make sure you check that out as well. They have some very nice quality products that you will want to know about, sis. They currently have a site-wide sale up to 90% off and you can also save an additional 30% off using my coupon code that you see here on the screen. Use the code, sis. Save your coins. You know I'm always in the business of saving your coins. Now, you have the option of going on their website, timu.com, or you can download the app. That's personally how I shop. It's super easy and convenient. I just go on the app, make my selections, put it in my shopping cart. I can select what I want to purchase at that time. It just works seamlessly, effortlessly, very conveniently. Again, all information will be listed in the description box. So check it out, sis. All right, so let's get into this beautiful unit I'm reviewing today. It is this 13 by four Brazilian Water Wave Transparent Lace Frontal Wig. And I do have her in 24 inches, y'all. So let's go ahead and dive into the unboxing, the styling, and the installing of Super all right y'all so let's go ahead and get into the unboxing this is how the hair came packaged they did include a wig cap and this is the hair straight out of the package very nicely defined curls this is what the hairline looks like and as you can see it does have some baby hairs it does have a standard cap construction with the two combs on the sides one in the back with the adjustable straps this is that 13 by 4 parting space so i've already washed this hair off camera and i added some deep condition to it and placed it in this plastic bag now i'm going to use my thermal heat cap or bag um, to place this hair inside of and give it a little deep condition it is an electric version so all i basically did was just put the bag into the bag <laughs> and just closed it up i let it sit in here for about 30 minutes and gave it a nice deep condition as you can see i do have it on the high setting now i'm going to move on to the styling process starting with some cream of nature by argan oil leave-in conditioner i'm going to follow that up with some styling gel by elasta qp and the reason i like this styling gel is because it does not leave the hair feeling all hard and crinkly it literally feels like silk the hair is nice and soft when you use this product then i'm going to finish up with some foaming mousse by mix chicks I don't know it's just like these two combinations it makes the hair feels super soft y'all like so i just love using the combination of these two products together in addition to the leave-in conditioner as well now i'm just going to brush through the hair to get the curls nice and defined using my felicia leatherwood brush any other products that you see me using in this video will be listed down in the description box below so feel free to check it out if you're interested i also want to point out that i did pluck this hairline some more it did come pre-plugged but y'all know i'm extra and of course i had to go in and plug it some more and it gave me a good payoff so this is now the next day after I let the hair dry overnight and now I'm ready to go ahead and install. This unit did come down ear to ear. However, I do consider it to be a bit of a small to medium size cap. If you have a larger size head, there may be a little struggle. I mean, even with installing this wig, I had to go up and like cut in the lace to get it to fit around my ear. It was just kind of weirdly shaped. Um, it just wasn't sitting on my ear comfortably so i had to do that on both sides so for this install i'm going to be using the bold hold products today and i'm starting off with the uh, skin protectant i usually i used to spray it on my head but that just always made a mess and now i've gotten smart and i spray it on a napkin and just 
rub it on my head and then blow dry to get that to dry and then I follow that up with some liquid gold gel when you're here with me, babe, cause you're all I crave, so I wonder. One thing I've noticed about using the Bold Hold products, it could leave a bit of a mess as you see here. I mean, it gets a little flaky, but I mean, you know, you just gotta do a little cleanup afterwards and you know, that's just what it is. Because the adhesive spray kinda does the same thing, but maybe not as much. So I just wanna just point that out in case someone is interested in trying something new and you wanna know what the difference is. It's a little bit of a mess, but it does give it a wonderful melt. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why are you messing my head up? Any night, any day. So now I'm just adding some more foaming mousse around the edges because it can get a little hard when you're using that adhesive spray, especially that um, black can. It makes the hair a little hard around the edges, so I just want to soften it up a little bit. So, you know, it gives me a natural effect. After I got the hairline together, all I needed to do was get this hair together. So I just added some more water to soften it up a little bit more and, you know, get these curls back to some definition. I also wanted to add a little more volume. So I just used my blow dryer and, you know, just kind of blow dry it up at the root area. I would normally use my diffuser for something like this, but I couldn't find it at the moment. So this works just the same. So this little L'Oreal Magic Root Precision Brush, sa brush saves my life. Like it just covers up any imperfections you may have experienced during the installation process where you don't have to show any lace. I just love that brush, it's, it's a hit. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and add some layers because the hair is like all one length and you know, that's just not how I live. Like I needed to frame my face a little bit more, so yes. All right, y'all, so let's get into my thoughts. And you can probably already tell I am super excited about this one. This is so freaking cute to me, y'all. Like, oh, oh, this little waterway situation we got going on. Absolutely gorgeous and so perfect for the summer, y'all. Like, she is so summer ready. Mm, this is my jam right here in the summertime. I'm always going for a little curly unit. I love it, y'all. I love this. Look here, when I tell you this is some grade A quality hair, y'all. Look at these curls, y'all. Look at this. This hair is so soft, so defined. Oh my gosh, the hairline is hidden, honey. I'm sorry, I'm just impressed. I am in impressed. I am impressed. I love this. Oh, it's so gorgeous. So gorgeous. It's just giving me summertime vibes. And it's gonna easily be my go-to. <laughs> now, this unit did come 24 inches. Um, but when you get to defining the curls and you know blow drying her upwards, she kind of shifts her weight up so she don't look 24 inches. And I did a little chopping, as you saw. Like I needed to cut it to frame my face, because that's just what I do. And I highly, highly recommend you do the same. You know, you don't just want it to be like straight and blah. You want it to have a little dimension, a little, little layers up in this joint. So I am loving that, y'all. Like this hair is so nice. Timu, y'all came through. Timu comes through again. Yes, I did pluck this hairline, and she's looking amazing. Look at this. We can do a little half up, half down. Honey, the versatility. Ew. <laughs> I am so loving it. Oh gosh, this hair is beautiful. 
So because it's a water wave unit, I'm not like necessarily gliding my fingers through. So I'm not, I, I wouldn't give it tangly. However, yeah, honey, we are shedding up in this joint. Could be because of me. Again, I did pluck the hairline, you know. I had to cut off a little bit of the ear tabs since it was a little too long for me. I had to cut in the lace to get it to fit around my ear. Like, I had, I had to put in a little work on this one, y'all. I had to put in a little bit of work on this. But I love the outcome. So it was all very well worth it. So, I personally believe that that little uh, deep conditioning cap that I had the hair sitting in for a little while, it did this hair justice, okay? Like, this hair is so nice after a little deep condition. It's so moisturized, it's soft. Oh my goodness, it's defined. Like, that little cap, check the description box, sis. Check my Amazon storefront. It'll be there. It's a must-have. I will be using that for all of my curling units from now on. That's really all I have for y'all. Like, I, I've given you all of my deets on this gorgeous hair. And I highly recommend you check the, check this hair out on the Timu website, through the Timu app. Check out my affiliate links down in the description box. Save yourself some coins, sis. Every coin matters. <laughs> So, once again, huge shout out and thank you to Timu. I thank you all for taking the time to rock with me today. I truly do appreciate it as always. Please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you have not. And I will be sure to catch you beautiful people in the next video. When I need you most We got love guaranteed And I have to know Say